YouTube, YouTube, YouTube. It's your boy DIY Kari coming at y'all with another video. Today we got another special Travi coming to y'all. It's a UA, it's a rep. Yes, I know, I do rep UA reviews. And every rep UA I review is all for information purposes. So I'm helping y'all, helping myself at the time, same time by reviewing these shoes, showing y'all what's out there in the world across the water. Today, this special shoe came from my good people over at sophiakicks.ru. That's gonna be the website, WhatsApp, and my code to help you guys out, save some money in case y'all shop on the website and find something that y'all like. And if y'all like these shoes, y'all can save yourself $15 off. But to get straight to the shoe, this one is going to be part of the pink pack that is possibly coming out in 2025. I don't know for sure. Nobody knows for sure because they have not made it set in stone yet. But if they do, this is how they will look. The Dark Pony Travis Scott One Low. And as you can see right off the bat, that toe box is buttery, blue buck, brown, dark pony, however you want to say it. That is going to be the official colorway if they come out. Or they might change it up because we already got them. So they might change some things up. Like I said, it does not come out to 2025 if they release. This is a rendering, the first rendering of how they will look. You see they come with the brown laces and the pink laces. And already in the shoe, you have the white laces. It does come with the cardboard inserts. The lace tips are pink. At least on the white, um, the white laces, you got the pink tips. And I struggle every single time getting this freaking insert out. I don't know why, but that's gonna be one of the inserts with the Air Jordan Wings, Cat's Jack, and Jordan logo. On the lateral side, as you always see, the reverse Nike check, Travis Scott signature, medial. You got the regular Jordan. Regular Nike check, I don't know why I was about to say Jordan, but it is a Jordan, but it's the regular Nike check. Then you got the Cat's Jack running through it. At the back, you got that Sicko Mode logo. And that back heel also is gonna be a smooth leather. This one does not have the tumble leather. It's a smooth leather all the way around. Bottom, you got that pink outsole. On this one, same thing, smooth white leather, pink Travis Scott reverse check, pink regular Nike check with the Cactus Jack going through the middle. In the back, you got those wing logo. On the tongue, I pointed out on every Travis Scott, probably something pointed out in my last few videos that I reviewed of Travis Scott's, but it's because every single facing on this that has the cat's jack is different. They're all different. I don't know why. That's why I pointed out because I still don't understand why. I don't know if it's intentional or it's just something that happens in production. If y'all know, let me know in the comments because I don't. I just pointed out because I see it on every shoe, on every retail shoe that I have seen. It has that. Some have spacing, some have none, some have a large space. But the other thing that is on the tongue is that Nike Air. And it is on both Nike Air, Nike Air, 
And they got the cactus jack. Show y'all this one real quick. Cause the insole is different. We got the sicko mode, Nike Air and Travis Scott. And it's a brown ortho foam insole. Regular insoles that come with just about every Travis Scott's or just about every Jordan one that you can possibly get in the box nothing special we've been getting this box with just about every Travis Scott the brown itself this one did get a little ding up in transit but as y'all know comes a long way I've actually seen worse it's only a little ding up in the front with this size sticker which is 11 and a half because this is a women's exclusive but when you translate that to men's it's going to be a size 10 which is my size i'm a true size 10 so these do fit true to size never had any issues from sophia with my shoes not fitting properly they always fit true to size if y'all like these let me know in the comments again like i said i don't know if these are releasing or not it's still a possible because there is nothing set in stone this is definitely the first rending of them but i'm hoping that they do because this is to me a fire shoe it reminds me of the ice cream strawberry vanilla and chocolate that's what I think of when I see these. So, with that being said, let me know what y'all think of when y'all see this colorway. And if y'all thinking about copping or you're gonna wait to see if they release in 2025. Still not set in stone. And y'all know, Travis Scott's get backdoored. They, it's a lot of stuff that goes down with these. It's, so it's super hard to get your hands on them. If you do, you are a fortunate person because I can never win any release when these release. Which is why I went this route. And yeah, this is going to be those. I call them the ice cream, but the true name is going to be the dark pony. This is what DIY car. Y'all like the shoes. Y'all like the video. Make sure y'all comment below. Like, comment, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Really appreciate everybody else that's already subscribed. Keep watching because I got more videos on the way. Peace out.